We're taking the next step forward to make sure you can work with land effects in the software you want to use. If you prefer to work in the 3D modeling program, Rhinoceros or Rhino, we now have a plugin that gives you the tools to jump into 3D, play with your planting design, make changes, and jump back into 2D CAD for construction documents. You'll start with downloading and installing. It's easy. Go to our webpage for installing the Rhino plugin. Download the installer and the component library. Move the library to a local location or a mapped letter drive for collaboration. Double click the RHI file to install the plugin. Now open Rhino. Type toolbar in the command line. Navigate to this folder and click OK. You'll now have the Land Effects toolbar here right inside Rhino. Next, we'll change the settings. Navigate to your library folder location that you set up earlier. Put in the same LandFX support ID that you use in AutoCAD. To find it, look at your general preferences or go to our website. That should be all. You're ready to start importing plants. Make sure you've exported your design on the CAD side already. Your CAD drawing and Rhino model need to be in the same units, have the same origin location, and the same rotation on the XY axis. Use our UCS tool if you need to fix this on the CAD side. Now connect to the same LandFX project in Rhino. Click the Import tool and choose your plant symbols. You can also assign your own Rhino blocks by following the guide on our website. Click Import and let LandFX do the work for you. Plants come in at the right location correct size, and get a random rotation and height adjustment so the design looks natural and not like cut and pasted blocks. Our land effects blocks are optimized for looks and speed, so you can navigate your model quickly, even in rendered mode. Visualize and analyze. You can make changes here, export and import them back in CAD to update your callouts and schedules. It's really that easy to start using land effects in your existing Rhino workflow to start connecting all the platforms that you want to use.